All right. So, welcome to my new place. I recently moved, and uh, I'm so stoked to be here because um, I finally have my own office again. I have my own kind of jam space, and it is so good. So good to have some ability to stretch my legs and play guitar, and it's been great having this. And um, if you remember my old videos, then you definitely remember like the TV in the background, and like I was, in, I mean, quite literally at the end of the living room, you know, recording these videos for you. So it is good to have some space. Um, upon moving into the new space, one of the first new pieces of gear that I received was from the incredibly cool people over at Ernie Ball. This is something I've been really excited about for years. And there's been hints at it, there's been um, some guys that kind of do it in a different way. Um, there's been a lot to it, but there's never been this. And that's why um, when I saw this finally it was coming to market, I just had to reach out and say, hey, can I please have one? I want to make a demo for it. Um, so I think that's enough of that. The new pedal that we're doing looking at today is the Ernie Ball VP Junior Tuner. <laughs> That's right, this this thing right here is exactly what you've been thinking about, hoping for, and wanting for years. Ernie Ball finally came out with theirs. And it's incredible, it's so well made, it's like kind of heavy duty, it's got this really fat um, chassis on it. I mean, the thing is just a total beast. It's got this super, super clean LED on it. I mean, the LED is like three inches by two inches with the, I mean, it's really well lit. I mean, as you can clearly see, I'm not plugged into a pedal, but I've, I've got this in a one spot just to make sure you can see because this really is the, you know, the, the, the piece we're focusing on. As you can see, it does a couple um, different things here. So it, it tracks with you all the way up, all the way down, shows you the volumes where you're at, so one through 10, and then when you hit zero, it looks like it blanks out. Now when this is tuned or when this is plugged in, you'll see it obviously isn't blanked out. It's actually the tuner. When you hold down the lock button here on the bottom corner, so I'm gonna hold it down here, and what it's gonna do, it's gonna go to a screen that says unlock or cancel. So the, obviously if I didn't mean to hit it, I can cancel out. Now if I tap unlock, it's now unlocked and I can change some of the features on it, right? So, um, if I double tap here in the middle, it gives me those three options that I was just telling you about it. You can do the top one, which is volume and tuner. You can do um, the bottom left, which is volume, and then the bottom right, which is tuner. So um, I always have, since I've received, I've been hanging in the volume tuner combo because I like both. Um, but if I just choose volume, it'll switch over. So now I'm at zero, and it shows nothing on the LED. When I scroll to the top, it shows you where the actual volume is the cascading numbers all the way down, which is so good. Now same thing, we're gonna tap over to the tuner, and no matter what position I'm in, heel down, toe up, regardless, it's gonna stay in the tuner. It's not going to disengage its tuning abilities, it just doesn't show you um, the number, the cascading numbers on the screen the way it does. So then lastly, one of the other pieces is that when you tap um, the frequency range, it goes from 447 down to 432. I'm just not that kind of guitarist, so I'm not really gonna get to those things here. I hang with 440. I've tried some others, you know, some of the sweet tunings in the past, um, but they just didn't serve me well as much as I wanted them to. So we're gonna hang into the 440. Now I'm gonna hold down that lock button again, and what I do is gonna offer me cancel or lock. I'm gonna lock it, and then done. Now I don't have to worry about my son touching it too many times and unlocking it. I don't have to worry about my feet accidentally unlocking it some weird way. Um, and it goes right back to, oopsie, I'm still actually in tuner mode, so I gotta unlock it again. Unlock. Okay, so unlock, and then I'm gonna choose volume and tuner combo. Boom, tuner there, volume all the way through. So let's plug it in, see what it sounds like. Um, as soon as you get the opportunity, make sure to pick one of these things up. Before I get into what the rest of the playing is, rest of this demo, um, these things are incredibly well made. I mean, these things, they feel so good. This is the first tuner I've put on my board in like five years. I transitioned off of them, never went back, was totally fine without it because, I mean, my guitar has volume now. I was like, what do I need this for? But then these guys sent me one and I'm now, I'm, I'm a total sucker, I'm sold. So, let's play it, let's see what it sounds like, let's get into it.
Thank you.